In this episode, we're going to talk about why it's absolutely important that you answer your phone and don't let it go to voicemail, because you're probably simply pissing money away by letting it go to voicemail. Stick with me. You know, if you're running Google AdWords campaigns, or even if you're just using SEO, which we don't offer, we do specifically Google AdWords, but in any event, what's happening is your prospect is going to Google and they're doing a search and they're getting a number of search results. Hopefully your business comes up at the top. And what happens is they click on that link and then they're taken to hopefully your landing page and they do one of two things. They either fill out a contact form or they pick up the phone and call you. If they call you, what happens when nobody answers the phone? Now, let me put it this way. We're not living in 1992 anymore. So I, I, I'm not by any means trying to say that you won't get people who leave a message. You, you will, but you'll get a lot more people who simply hang up and go down to the next person on the list uh, the list being Google or Yahoo or wherever they found you, typically Google, and call that business. And they'll keep doing that until they get somebody who picks up the phone and talks to them. Now, even if they do leave a message frequently, what will happen is they'll then go back to Google and call the next person on the list, the next search result that comes up, be it a, a, an ad or SEO. And so what happens is the prospect keeps calling and calling until they get somebody who picks up the phone. So what happens is, or what is happening is that you're paying, uh, you, you know, regardless of your marketing effort, you're likely paying anywhere from $25 to $100 or more per lead. And what's happening when somebody calls and nobody's answering your phone and 75% of the time they're hanging up their phone and calling the next person at Google, is that you're literally just flushing the money that you've spent for leads down the toilet. So now you may be thinking, well, what do I do? I'm a small one person business or I'm a mom and pop, or even, you know, even if we do have five or six or 10 employees, we just can't afford to have somebody manning the phones 100% of the time. Well, look, you, you need to, you need to figure this out. And if you, if you can't answer the phone, then you need to hire somebody who can answer the phone. Now, here's a couple of solutions you can look into. Number one, there are live answering services that you can hire that will answer the phone for you. Now, you may be thinking, yeah, but they can't sell. They're never going to know the intricacies and the details of my service business. Doesn't matter. All you need is a live voice who picks up the phone and says, you know, thanks for calling. I'm going to definitely have a, a, a practitioner call you back within the next couple of hours and take down their personal information. And they feel that they've actually gotten through to somebody. There's a warm voice on the other end of the line. And that is super, super important. It means that they're not just automatically hanging up. And remember, I, I venture to say at least 75% of people are hanging up when nobody answers the phone. So you can get, you can hire a call service and it's very affordable. What you want to look for in a good call service is one that immediately plugs your caller through to an operator, to somebody, to a, a human that actually answers the phone. A lot of these companies don't. What they do is they have a, an answering uh, message that picks up the phone and says, please hold while we connect you to an operator. And then immediately starts playing elevator music. No good, in my opinion. You want somebody who's going to immediately answer the phone. Now, there's another alternative you can do is you can also just run an ad on your local Craigslist and find somebody locally, like a stay-at-home mom or stay-at-home dad, uh, who you can forward your number to during certain hours when you're not available, when you're working or when you're out or when you just can't get to the phone and have that person answer the the phone for you. And again, they don't need to go through your whole sales pitch. All they've got to do is just be a warm blooded, warm voiced human being that actually picks up the phone. Super important guys. Listen, take my advice, get somebody to answer that phone ideally by the second ring and you are going to see your sales go through the roof.